life jackets are stored here by the muster station. Let me show you how to put one on. First, put the life jacket over your head. Then tie the straps in a double bow on the left hand side like this. You inflate the jacket by pulling down on the toggles. Please don't do this until you're on an outside deck. Oh, excuse me. Can I just stop you there? I'm afraid you're trying to pull down on your whistle. That's for blowing when you're in the water to attract attention. The toggles are here. That's right. Good. Can I have two gin and tonics, a double scotch, and a tomato juice, please? Yes, sir. Would you like ice and lemon in the GNTs? Yes, please. But I'll have the scotch with no ice. No, actually, I'll have a soda with it. And can I have a large glass of Chardonnay, too? Would you like ice with your scotch? No, thanks. My wife and I are thinking about taking the scuba diving trip on the next offshore excursion. Do we need to have experience? No, sir, none at all. Full training will be given and you'll be supervised by an instructor at all times. And what about insurance? Scuba diving is usually classed as a high-risk sport, and I'd advise you to check with your travel insurance company that you're covered for this activity, sir. We can't accept liability for anything that may happen. Everything all right, ma'am? How is the stick? Well, to be frank, it's a little rare for my taste. I don't mind lamb cooked rare, but I'm not so keen on rare steak. Would you like me to ask the chef to cook it a little more? If it's no trouble. See how pink it is. I did ask for well done, you know. This is Mrs. Stone in room 437. We have a big problem with this cabin and need to change. The one we're in stinks of stale cigarette smoke. Our clothes hanging in the closet all smell of smoke now. I'm sorry to hear that. I'll send the steward up to you right away and we'll see what we can do. Patricia, your face is really red. It is? The sun must be stronger here than I thought. I don't usually burn, so I rarely use suntan lotion. Yeah, well, we can't escape the sun in our work. If I were you, I'd wear a hat. Good idea. Excuse me, ma'am. Can I get by? Sure. Sorry for being in the way. Those look like heavy trays. How do you carry so much without dropping it? You must be exhausted by the end of the day when the ship's so busy. <laughs> it takes practice. You need quite strong arms. But the most important thing is to keep your balance, especially when the sea's a bit choppy. When will the food be ready? We've been waiting for a half hour. I'm very sorry, but when you order something that is not on the main menu, it takes a little longer. It'll be ready in ten minutes. Can I offer you something while you wait? Perhaps another drink? Okay. I'll have another orange juice. What would you like, Joyce? I'll have the same. And can you hurry, please? We were also waiting 20 minutes for the last drink. I was wondering if you could show us how to play this game. Deck coils? Oh, sure. You have to throw these small coils of rope over the pegs to score points, like this. The one with the most points wins. Make sure your foot is behind the line, otherwise it is a foul throw. Oh, I see. Thank you. A guest in cabin C-346 on B-deck has complained that no clean towers were left in her room this morning. C-346 B-deck. That's one of the family cabins, isn't it? Oh, yes, I remember. Uh, they left the bathroom in an awful mess. There was water all over the place, and it took me ages to clean it up. I must have forgotten the towels. Go and see to it now, please, and pay more attention next time. Remember, our guests expect the highest standard of service. Okay, sorry. I'd like some red wine with my meal, but my wife prefers white. Is wine available by the glass? All our house wines are all available by the glass, sir. And we also do Cabernet by the half bottle. Mmm, I only want one glass. 
In that case, I'll have a glass of the house Merlot and a glass of Chardonnay for my wife. Oh, and we'd like a bottle of sparkling mineral water as well, please. Very good, sir. Excuse me, I have a question. Will I be able to use US dollars at the next stop? Yes, ma'am, but I would recommend you take some pesos with you so you can get a better price when shopping in the market. But don't change too many, as you won't be able to use them at the next port of call. Thank you. I'll exchange $100 then. Darn it, I'm going to be late for my appointment. Can I help you, madam? I'm looking for the beauty salon. I thought it was around here somewhere, but I can only see the souvenir store. The beauty salon is one deck below, madam. Go down the main staircase here, then turn right, and the salon is halfway down the corridor on your left, next to the gym. How are you enjoying your cruise so far, sir? Oh, I'm having a marvellous time. I'm expanding a bit round the middle, though. I'll have to start doing a bit of exercise soon to keep in shape. You could pay a visit to the sports area, sir. You can do many different sports there. Virtual golf, volleyball, cricket and tennis. There are even coaches if you need a hand to get started or want some professional training. That sounds great. I'll call by tomorrow. In the meantime, I'll, uh, I'll have another double scotch with ice, please. What are you planning to do today? There's a galley tour on program at 10 a.m., I believe. Really? That would be interesting. Oh, yes, it's very popular, madam. You get to see what goes on behind the scenes, and coffee and cake is served after the tour. No, better not. I've scheduled a game of tennis with a friend at 10 a.m., and I don't want to cancel on her. I think I overdid it in here yesterday. The muscles in my arms and legs are really sore, and my back is killing me. You should use the sauna, ma'am. It helps to relax the muscles after exercising. Is there one on board? Yes, ma'am. It's in the spa complex on the Lido deck. There's also a steam room and jacuzzi. And you can have a massage there, too, if you like. Great. Sounds perfect. Did you enjoy your day on shore, sir? Oh, yes. It was wonderful. We walked around the old city, visited a couple of museums, and did some shopping at the market. Did you take one of our organized excursions or go off by yourself? Since it was our first time on shore, we thought we'd play safe, so we took your half-day guided tour. But next time, we're planning to be a bit more adventurous and hire a car so we can be a bit more independent. My mother and I would like to take a trip to see the film when we get to Bergen, but aren't sure which one to take. Although she enjoys walking, she's recovering from a broken ankle and can't walk very far. In that case, I suggest you opt for Tour A or Tour D, madam. They're both coach and ferry tours which take in the fjords, but involve very little walking. They're very popular with the elderly guests. What time does the presentation on Cape Town start? At 8pm, sir, in the Blue Lounge. Seating is on a first-come, first-served basis. Oh, that's too bad. I have an appointment with my personal trainer in the gym at that time, and I really don't want to cancel it. I've been a bit lazy recently, and I'm starting to feel very unfit. I need a good workout. Well, sir, you can always watch it on your in-cabin entertainment program. Yeah, that's a good idea. Where can I see the photos taken last night? Are they on view in the lounge? All photos taken by our onboard photographers can be viewed in the photo gallery, ma'am. And where is that? It's on the promenade deck, next to the sundown bar, ma'am, and directly opposite the library. You can reach it easily if you use the lifts over there. Good evening. How can I help you? Uh, hi there. This is Mr. Prince in cabin 204. I'm wondering if you could send someone in to change a light bulb that's burned out. Excuse me, sir. Do you think you could turn down the TV in your room? I didn't catch all your message. Any more bets? $25 on Black 24. Thank you, sir.
20 red. Better luck next time, sir. Is there anywhere I can watch the cup final on a large screen in one of the public rooms? Winner's Bar is the place you want, sir. It has a large screen TV for showing both live and recorded sports events, and you can enjoy a drink at the same time. Great. Where is it? It's on promenade deck at the forward end of the ship. It's very popular, especially with our male guests. So if I were you, I'd get there early, before the match starts if you want a good seat. Excuse me, do you have a selection of vegetarian dishes? Certainly, ma'am. Here's the menu. All the dishes marked V are vegetarian. And today's special is tomato and red pepper tart with a spicy cucumber salad. Will the spicy salad blow my head off? <laughs> no, I don't think so. But if it's a problem, we can give you a creamy coleslaw salad instead. Do you have any dance classes on board? Oh yes, madam, we have an excellent Latin American instructor who teaches salsa, merengue, and samba. Oh, that's great. I've been wanting to learn Latin American dancing for a long time. The trouble is, I've got two left feet. Is that going to be a problem? No, 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 don't worry. We have beginner's classes, so your two left feet won't be a problem. And what time are the classes, please? Good morning. Hope you're enjoying your cruise. Please let us know if there's anything we can do to enhance your cruise experience. We're expecting some very nice weather over the next 24 hours, with temperatures reaching a maximum of 26 this afternoon and dropping to a very pleasant 24 degrees tonight. Please remember to take care during the hottest part of the day, from 1 to 3, when the sun is at its strongest. Also, please don't forget that at 2300 hours, we'll be starting our midnight ball in the Victoria Lounge. Good morning, ma'am. Can I help you? Yes. I'd like to exchange euros for lira for the trip this afternoon. Uh, certainly, ma'am. How many euros would you like to change? Two. No, make that 300. Um, no. Hold on. What's the rate right now? Today's rate is 1.78. Oh, in that case, I think I'll exchange for 100 things. My husband likes the room cool at night, but it's a bit too cold for me. Can I have an extra blanket? No problem, madam. I'll go and fetch you one now. Shall I get one for your husband as well? No thanks. He doesn't get as cold as I do. But he would like an extra pillow. He has asthma and can breathe easier when he has three pillows rather than just two. Certainly, madam. I'll be back with the thing in five minutes or so. Will you be attending the Shasha evening in the pink ballroom this evening? It's a lot of fun and usually very popular with the guests. No, <laughs> I don't think so. I'm no good at dancing. I've got two left feet. I prefer to sit at the bar and watch other people make fools of themselves. Well, why don't you join the dance classes? They're heard every morning at 11 in the Blue Lounge. Just go along and join in. I'm sure our instructors will have you dancing the night away in no time. What could be better than travelling from one exotic place to another on board a luxury cruise liner? Most popular cruise destinations boast some of the calmest waters in the world. However, it isn't always plain sailing for the guests on board. Motion sickness can affect even the most experienced traveller. Modern ship design, the right kind of medicine, and the assistance of a friendly purser can all help to prevent queasiness from spoiling the holiday of a lifetime. Today, we're talking to staff on board a luxury cruise ship about their experiences at sea and their advice for keeping sickness at bay. <laughs> 